hey guys welcome back to my channel i uh, hope you're doing good under the virus circumstances i know it's been a while i am so sorry about that um life so today i'm going to be showing you how i achieved this half up half down a ponytail with my bald head so stay tuned as you can see my head is completely bald and right now i'm just showing you how the wig is constructed i constructed this wig but i'm gonna go into i'm gonna create a detailed video on how i construct my wigs um this one it was hand constructed but i'm gonna be doing a video on how i construct my wigs using a sewing machine stay tuned it's also going to be my first time so i'm going to be taking you through the process uh you guys are going to be going along with me through the process my mistakes you're going to see so that when you're doing it yourself you can see how to prevent those mistakes so right now i'm using the got to be glued in the yellow tab i'll show you in a second uh, now the great thing about this product is it's now available in south africa discam has it i will link it down below if they do have it online you'll find out right now so i'm not really going to be talking a lot in this video i'm not really good at voiceovers so you can just watch me see how i do things maybe you can mimic it when you do it comment down below and let me know how you feel about this yeah So right now I'm just looking to see if there are any sections that are not uh, glued down properly. You know, um, the lining of the lace tends to not be glued properly and then I just go back to the cut to be glued and glue it again. In order to make the lace uh, less visible, I use um, a face powder. I'm gonna link it down below because I forgot which one I use, or I'm just gonna pop a picture right on the screen. But it must be closer to your skin tone in order to reflect or mimic scalp. <laughs> So right now I'm preparing to create the ponytail. Guys, this was not easy. <laughs> if you know what I mean, it was not easy. You're going to see my struggle. You know, I struggled to do this, but eventually I got it and I did it. Thank God to the God to be glued because it uh, didn't lift at all. And besides, it was a cold day, so I wasn't sweaty. give you much details on the hair because it was a supplier that was that I was testing for my own um, brand which is upcoming I was not pleased with the hair so uh, the only thing that I liked was the the lace it was quite big and it was kind of easy to manipulate but I didn't like the hair texture um, 
I also didn't like the fact that the lace was kind of dark, darker than my skin tone. I like transparent or transparent or um, HD lace, HD lace. English is not my first language, so you're gonna hear me saying words that are not pronounced the same. currently using a Safeway flat iron that I bought two years ago uh, at Clicks, so I'm not really sure if they still have it. Um, I actually like the amount of heat it provides, 220 is enough for me. Um, some flat irons will go up to 400 which will just burn your hair so that 200 is perfect for me. It'll give you an instant straight and a perfect curl. But I will try and find it if they and see if they have it. I really give credits to those that can flat iron while the wigs are on their heads because this thing it's so not easy it's literally not easy I like using the the, the mannequin head rather because my arms were killing me and I didn't even know how to twist it I think it's because I'm left-handed but it was not easy Don't worry about the heat uh, or the steam that's coming out that you're seeing. It's actually caused by the um, protective spray. So yeah, that's it guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. And also, most of all, I hope you've learned something that you can apply to yourself um, because I've also learned a lot from actually watching YouTube. So I'm also hoping that you can learn from me as well. And don't forget to comment, like and subscribe. Let me know what you think about it. Did you like it? Did you not like it? What didn't you like about it, about this hairstyle? And just let me know your overall thoughts. A few days later, I mean, not a few days later, obviously, a few hours later, 
the I felt that the the ponytail was a little bit too tight, so I changed it. I just took it off and styled it like this. Thank you guys for watching. Bye. Enjoy.